I had some spare time this weekend and was bored of babysitting, so went ahead and made something interesting to kill my time and use some of the scrap wood I've been collecting for ages. For this project we need pallet wood, protective equipments like face mask, glasses, gloves, sanding tool, hammer, measuring tape, nails, hand saw or chop saw, knife, pliers, pencil and paint of your choice. Using two hammers I'm going to dismantle the pallet. My aim is to reuse all the nails used in building this pallet so that I can use them in building my stool. A stool is a highly useful piece of furniture that comes in handy at any point of time, such as to sit and to reach out places that you can't reach without some additional support. Let's start by cutting the wooden pieces required for the project. My pallet is 9cm wide and 2cm thick. So if I want to make a perfect square, I would need 12 36 cm blocks for the two opposite sides and the top. 8 32 cm blocks for the other two sides. 4 38 cm blocks of legs which will also hold the sides. For the base we need 2 32 cm blocks for the center bit and 2 28 cm blocks for the side bits. And finally few random sized blocks to hold the sides. Before putting the blocks together I'm going to sand them to give them a nice and smooth texture. Now let's start by putting the two identical sides together. For that I'm going to use the 4 32 cm blocks and the 2 38 cm legs. Once the sides are ready, I'll use the 8 36 cm blocks to join these sides to each other to give it a square shape. But before joining the fourth side, I'm putting the bottom bits together. There are so many styles, shapes and types of stools available online, but the real fun is to make one yourself using your own time and creativity. Many people choose them to add a bit of charm to their home interior and exterior decoration. Cool, so that's how the box looks like without the top lid. Now let's put the lid together and place it over the box. This is another beautiful creation of the wooden pallet that is recycled into an excellent piece of work. This is a versatile piece of furniture which can be placed in the living room, bedroom, study, kitchen or even outdoors. Awesome, look at that. To fill the holes, I'm mixing sawdust with a bit of wood glue and then filling the holes up with the mixture. I will sand it once the glue dries up to give it a smooth finish. Black is my favorite color, so I'm going to paint this tool with water-based black paint. Now to draw the circles, I'm going to use the lid of Pringles Potato Chips paperboard can. As the stool will be used inside the house, I don't want the wooden legs to scratch the tiles of my floor. So to avoid that, I'm putting some hot glue under the legs. You can also use rubber base for this. This tool is lightweight, yet sturdy, comfortable to sit on and highly functional as it can be moved around the house, giving a dynamic and entertaining experience. Thanks again for watching this video. I hope it helps you. If you want to support me, you can subscribe to my channel and watch my other videos. Thanks. See you again in my next video. Bye now.